Hi, my name is Maya McCone Sweet, and I've been coming to St. Bart's Church for almost six years. As many of you know, my dad is Reverend Mark, which means I've been going to church since I was very little. With church, I've been fortunate enough to go on mission trips, be part of youth group, be an acolyte, sing in choir, and feed our neighbors. My time at church has always been enjoyable, and I have great friends, but it never deeply changed my life until I started high school. Last year, as part of confirmation class, I was taught to question everything I've been taught to believe and come to my own conclusions, including questioning my relationship with God and Jesus. During painful events such as the shooting of the local synagogue last year, I am grateful that we were not silent. Rather, we gathered and stood up against evil and hatred. Despite such responses of love and faith, I continued to question. Why is there pain? Did Jesus really resurrect? The questions are endless. With these questions, I prayed, consulted faith leaders and my mentors. But I've also come to some realizations. I was able to be confirmed even with my questions. I am led by God, my faith community, and my friends despite my questions. And I am welcomed, as, welcomed at St. Bart's for who I am. And so are you. To be clear, St. Bart's fosters more questions than answers. And the greater the diversity we can achieve, the closer we will be to Jesus. I am proud that our youth group is diverse. Race, sexuality, political, and economic life experiences. In the youth group, I formed many friendships and had many amazing experiences. One aspect that is not talked about enough, though, is the importance of our adult mentors and youth director. Each and every one of these adults has put countless numbers of hours towards the youth group at St. Bart's. They're always there for when you need a shoulder to cry on, ears to listen, or a laugh. Outside a youth group, I've spent my time as part of the church choir. Moving from the children's to the adult choir last year was a big deal to me. I was honestly scared to be singing with professional musicians who had been singing their whole entire adult life. But as you may have known, and if you know anyone in choir, you know that they will help you get right back on track and immediately make you part of the choir family. Most importantly, St. Parts has become a safe place for me and my second home, always accepting me where I am in my life and teaching me more about my faith. As I continue my faith journey as I head into adulthood, I want to thank each and every one of you for your contributions that have helped make all my youth crew and other experiences possible. Your generosity continues to make lasting impact on all the youth crew. Thank you.